So I'm here at Tommy's 4th Street Bar and Grill in Corvallis, Oregon. I made the about 45 minute drive because I have one and maybe two people who are fans and followers who wanted to meet me and do a challenge. So the challenge inside is a big giant breakfast challenge. I've done it before, but um, I got a couple people and I'm craving breakfast. So let's go inside and just see exactly what the Beaver Buster Breakfast Challenge is. All right, so we're here at Tommy's on 4th Street, and this is their Beaver Buster Challenge. I brought a couple friends with me. I brought Devin. You can see with those muscles, he'll just pick me up and throw me home if I'm too weird to drive. <laughs> Down on the end, we got Chris. This is my first time doing a food challenge with them. So Chris, how do you think you're gonna do? Yeah, we'll give it a try. Devin, with biceps like that, you have to eat like this every day. This is no problem. I'm pretty hungry. All right, now we, the record time is seven minutes. Ah, uh, yes, seven minutes by Molly Schuyler. I'm sure you know who that is. And seven minutes seems a little slow for her, let's be honest. But this challenge has been completed by Patrick Pacman Thomas, Randy Santel, Ethan Teske, Molly Schuyler. And this is my third time doing it. So we're gonna add my picture to the wall and we're gonna add two more to the wall of fame. Let's do it. We have one hour to do it. Set. And go! Um, you guys need any syrup or anything? I'm How about some syrup? Yeah. Sugar free if you can for the pancakes. No, actually, yes, please. So you live here in Corvallis? Progress. We'll get it. That's like enough for a week. I mean, mm -hmm. how many calories do you think it is? I have to get that take my picture. Mm -hmm. I think even with Aaron Rodgers, you still run for a yard. Oh, yeah. So then you just put in your big package, mm -hmm. you give it to your biggest running back, and say, Get me a yard. Yep. Three minutes left. 
It was good. It was great. It was a lot. They say it weighs seven and a half pounds. It's probably with the about three quarter pound tray. It is for sure over six pounds of delicious, tasty, homemade, cooked in house, giant portion breakfast. We can see here that Devin got a good chunk of his down. Try it. Chris over there gave it a good effort. I'm still working. <laughs> so, Devin, what'd you think? It was good. Good food, just uh, more than I had the capacity for today. Not <laughs> today. How about you, Chris? Pretty good. You know, Devin said it right. He's like, you could go to a Sherry's or a Denny's or some other cookie cutter place and pay $18 for a crappy breakfast that is a tenth of the portion, or you can keep your local dollars local, support a small local business, get more food, better quality, better taste with the residents that live in your community by coming here. That's part of why we do this. We want to keep support local businesses, keep our local dollars local. You can go to a Sherry's or a Denny's anytime, but you can't come to Tommy's on 4th just anytime. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna link. I'm gonna link to these guys' profiles and all sorts of wonderful stuff in the description box below. Check them out. Look at this man and his guns. <laughs> you know what he does. I mean, seriously, seriously. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. No, I'm not going to put his phone number down. <laughs> you want it, I'm not going to give it to you. You can find it some other way. So anyway, I hope you liked the video. Give it a thumbs up, and thanks for watching.